Hi, my name is Yusuf Ali and I am an OS fellow at MDA. I am going to give a demo of the app that we built. Before a drug going into clinical trial, safety of the drug need to be ensured. The key metric that you use to support the safety is safety margin and the severity and nature of the fine toxicity findings. This is an R shiny app that calculates exposure margin and safety margin and it generates plot that shows dose with exposure margin and it also shows finding with degree of severity in the same plot. When this information, dose, exposure margin, findings with severity is put together for several studies, it helps in the evaluation of the safety of the drug. So this is an application or program that we built. It has six studies, has the six studies for dog and rats. So this box represents one study. So dog four weeks IV. So this small box is for dose. The green box represents the novel value and black box for other value. So when you hover over it show the exposure margin. In the right side plot, these are the dose and when you hover over it show the findings. If you click on the show dose with exposure margin, it will show the dose and exposure margin and in the hover text, it will show the notes for the study. You can filter the dose, so less than or equal to novel. This will show the, on the dose that are equal or less than novel. Greater than novel will show all the dose that are greater than novel and it will show the corresponding findings here. By default, this exposure margin calculated based on human equivalent dose formula. So you can choose CMAX that will calculate the exposure margin from the CMAX value and it will show here. These are the exposure margin based on CMAX. You can choose AUC that will update the uh, exposure margin here. So this exposure margin based on HED and start dose, 1.5 milligram. If you choose MRHD, that will update the exposure margin and it will be calculated from the MRHD. The study here will match order from here. So you can change the order here that will update the order in the, in the plot. You can remove study from here. So there are only three studies shown here. You can increase the Plot height that will show the study. So when you want to compare a specific study side by side, you can uh, put them side by side from here. The same thing is true for findings. You can change the order of the findings. So A is increased, A is increased here. You can remove some findings. So the on the seven findings from here. You can add them back. So this plot show dose with exposure margin for a study and it also show the finding in the right plot. And this color is the severity of the findings and the legend here. So more severe, more plot the rate. You can download this figure as a PNG file. This clinical relevance table that summarizes the findings. So for ALT increased that are common in dog four weeks and dog 39 weeks. ACT increased is common in these four studies. And this table also show reversibility study, dose, and clinical exposure margin. You can filter from here. You can filter study too. You can download CSV or Excel file. Also, it can be downloaded as top file. This finding will match order from here. So you can change the order of the finding here from here. The key finding table show the study and it shows the Noel value, CMAX for Noel, AOC for Noel, safety margin, and it show all the finding that are found greater than Noel value. Study here will match the order from here, so you can change order from here, and that will update order here. The 
the safety margin table show the study with uh, Novel Velo, Novel Dose, HED, CMAX, MC, safety margin at the starting dose, and safety margin at MRHD dose if provided. All the table can be downloaded as doc file. In the download program tab, you can download this application or program as a RDS file, and you can come back and upload this file here. So that will generate the same plot for the same data. So this is, these are the main functionality of this app that help in the uh, evaluation of the safety of the drug before a drug going into clinical trial. So in summary, this is an R shiny app that generate a plot and also generate table uh, for summarizing clinical uh, exposure margin uh, for summarizing the findings of different toxicological studies. Now I will show you how to enter the clinical and non-clinical data. So by default, this is the new program. So let's say we want to build a uh, program called demo2. So it will select the demo2. So you need to provide the unit for CMAX and AFC. So by default, it's nanogram per ml for CMAX and nanogram hour per ml for AFC. You can change that if you want. So for clinical data, there are three checkbox. So I want to enter star dose and MRST. So I'll check that these two. So by default, this dose will be milligram per day. If you want to enter star dose and MRST, like all these dose in milligram per kg per day, you can choose that. So this will update here. So I want to enter as milligram per day. In that case, I need to also I also need to enter. I also need to provide the human weight. So by default, it's 60. Start dose 1.5. Start dose CMAX 2. Start dose AOC 13. So MRA is D is 2. CMAX D and AOC is 18. So then I will hit save clinical information. This will save the clinical information for us. And then I will add one study at a time. So for in the non-clinical data, you choose non is a new study. So from the selected species, you select the species, let's say dog, and I'll give a short name for weeks IV. So so study name is dog for weeks IV, we'll be updated here. So then you need to provide the number of dose, like how many dose you have for this particular study. Let's say you have two dose. For the first dose, let's say you have 0.23. CMAX 97, AUC 76, and then it will ask whether this dose is novel or not. So I'll check this as novel. So second dose I'll provide at 0 0.8. CMAX 534 and AUC 1098. Then it will ask how many findings you have for this study. I'll say two findings. The first finding is stomach erosion. So, and then it will ask whether this finding is reversible. So there are four options. So I'll say this is not assessed and then it is present at the dose one and it is mild at the dose two and then finding two i'll say ast in this and this is reversible and this is might and might and then i'll add some note that's a note for the weeks and then i'll save a study when i click the save a study this will generate the plot so we for this dog for weeks we add two dose these two dose and we added two findings in similar fashion we can add another study here from this non-clinical part so this is how we build this application demo application <clears throat> so we provided this uh, clinical information and then we build six studies one by one like for new study we provided one study and then another one so we, there are six studies so 
D6 study is shown here and D6 study is also showing here. Thank you for watching the demo. If you have any question, feedback or suggestion, feel free to reach us.